Hi, I'm Anthony Hudson. Now it's time for Saturday afternoon football. A few empty seats in the crowd. Gary Lyon joins me for this match. Welcome, Gaz. Hi, Hutto. Really excited about this one today. Today's match, Cawthon and Port Adelaide. fans making some noise as they step onto the field. I'm really looking forward to seeing how they play today. You're right, Hutto. It's a big day for the Port Adelaide. Defenders, they can stop Cawthon from being dominant inside 50. They've got a big chance to win this. Hawthorne looking ready as they enter the ground. The cheer squad's hard work is paying off. The banners are looking great. The captains make their way to the middle for the toss. Hawthorne wins the toss. Just waiting for the opening siren now. The umpire gets things underway. McAvoy gets onto the ball. A bit too hard with the push, and it's a free kick. Wingard has resources out wide. The ball finds Stratton. Works it across the ground. Scrimshaw gets the loose ball. Pushes through with power. Wines creates a contest. Great attack on the ball carrier. Ball up call. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? It's a really entertaining game of football. Rockland just threw it. McAvoy kicks it. Warple takes it well. He lays off the pass. Hurried kick. Just gave it away. Movement by hand. Rockland goes with the kick. Now we'll get a ball up. One down. Hits him hard. And now we'll have a ball up. McAvoy just slaps it down. Scrimshaw getting a chance for a break. My ball, says the umpire. McAvoy clears the contest. Takes possession. Found a way through. Warple with a shorthand pass. Hacking it out of there. Smooth goes off the ground. Warple now heading to the bench for a break. Umpire calls for the ball. Won it down. Is in his possession. Handballs. Dixon charges with intent. Handballs to a teammate on the run. Shields just threw it. Puts it on the boot. Stands tall and marks. Patton short by hand. At full stride, receives the handball. Gives it to Gunston. Wines steals possession. Neither team with a score as yet. Gets a quick kick away. Jonas missed an opportunity to mark. That one rams into the post. Weighing up the options now. Decides to play on. The kick releases the pressure. Henderson runs onto the field. Well, it'll be a ball up near the boundary line. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? I'm liking what I'm seeing at the moment, Hutto. A great game of footy. Frost gets in a good position. Shields has well to mark. The distance might be just beyond him. 
Going for goal number one. Jonas will be upset with that. Deciding where to go with the kick in. He gives chase to the footy. Uses the bump. This is Jonas. Releases the handball. Wines gives it off. And now they go. Gets the ball out of heavy traffic. Heads long with that kick. Can't take possession. Ball up in the centre square. Both sides are set up really well defensively early. Clumsy tackle results in a free kick. Looks for a target inside 50. Nice work from Shields. 40 metres out. Goes for the goals. The drop part sails between the big sticks. Shields love kicking that one. And we have the first goal of the match. The umpire set to bounce to restart the game. Receives the handball and takes off. They can create from this. Ball up in the centre square. O'Brien won the hit out. With the ball now. Picked off the deck. Williams going for number one. Goal! His teammates rush over. Port Adelaide get themselves on the board. About to resume play. Punches are clear. He gets his hands on the footy. Watts making his way onto the field. And we'll get a throw in. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? This is a classic game we're seeing right now. Dixon goes by hand. And now Folk has it now. Takes off now. He might kick a goal. Pinpoint accuracy from Westhoff. Smiles all round. Port Adelaide have kicked back-to-back -back goals. Port Adelaide get themselves in front. Dixon moves it by hand. And now they're away. Burgoyne got hands to it. Slick with the hands. The ball in the hands of Cleary. Gets it away. He can take off after that handball. Receives the handball and takes off quickly onto the boot. Picks up the loose ball. Hawthorne will be looking to get the lead with this shot. A time to celebrate. And don't they get around Bruce. The Hawks take back the lead. Taps it down. Henderson now. Just threw the ball. Looks up with a kick. Takes a simple grab. Kick by Motlop. Glass gets on the end of this. Gets into a good position to take that. Henderson drives the kick. Shields leaps over the top. Kicks it out at the fence. He has to hold on to those. The umpire will ball it up. Tap down. Burgoyne there to mop up. Handball's out into space. Intervening brilliantly was Warple. Burn Jones rushes with the kick. Ebert could grab the lead with this kick. Kicks long for goal and misses. Not many players can make it from that distance. Port Adelaide produced the margin. Looking to bring it back into play. Taking a nice grab. Sinks the slipper into it. Frawley takes the mark. Uncontested. The kick from Scully. Off hands. Watts throws the ball away. The siren sounds and that's the end of the opening term. The scores, Hawthorne, 14, took the power, 13. Hawthorne have come to play. They've got themselves in the game and need to push on now. Let's check out the stats. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get We're ready for second quarter action. 
Back in the middle to resume play. Hammers it. The loose ball picked up. Dug it out. Pal Pepper blinks with a teammate who can run. Pal Pepper just threw it. Warple kicks it. Finds a target. Impey plays on. Nobody can hold on here. Kicks hurriedly. Doesn't take the mark. Applies a bump. McAvoy dismisses his opponent with the stain. Penetrating handball. Mocklock with the intercept. He gets above the crowd. Got boot to ball. Frost takes the mark. Gets some distance on the kick. They chase after the loose ball. Mitchell goes for territory. Jonas takes it well. Fantastic chase and tackle. Didn't get away from the tackle. Fantastic pressure there. Takes a nice mark. Cuts the kick in board. Great mark under pressure. Puts boot to ball. Sutcliffe runs after this one. Westock gains some territory. Ball is touched and just a minus score. Frawley ready to bring it back into play. He runs it over the line. Missed opportunity with the handball. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? This is a great game, Hutto, and we can just sit back and enjoy it. Piopolo dropped what he should have taken. Cleanly picked up. Clears the congestion. He drives it towards goal. A chance to soccer it and kicks the goal. That's his first. Piopolo celebrates with the fans. The Hawks have kicked the last two goals. The lead is now six. Swatson. Burgoyne keeps coming. Burgoyne throws the ball away. Ebert has resources out wide. Smith gets a quick kick away. Gathers it now. Piopolo has a chance to put a second goal on the board. Hawthorne by seven points. Players move as they look to provide an option. Had the pressure bearing down. Smith gains some territory. He gives it a ride. He acknowledges the crowd. Hawthorne have kicked the last three goals. The margin is 13. Just gets it onto the boot. Does well to cut off the kick. Kicks the ball deep. A solid mark from Smith. Hawthorne, we're allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Pal Pepper with a penetrating handball. Williams loves that goal. Just two goals in it. Umpire ready to resume play. McAvoy just swats it away. He wins possession. Burgoyne just threw it. Chose to kick it. Cleary found a way to mark that one. Moves it by foot. And the mark will be paid. Rosie with a chance. If he can keep his cool. Decides to kick. The mark is taken by Burton. Hawthorne is struggling to maintain the pace of the game. They might need to slow it down and take some uncontested marks to get the game back on their terms. Ends up turning this ball over. Ball up called. What can you tell us, Gaz? This is a great game, Hutto, and we can just sit back and enjoy it. Just put his hands in the back of the opponent, and it's a free. Williams uses it by foot. Intercepts the ball well. Goes with the kick. Henderson looking to track down the footy. Slams it on the boot. Wins the race to the ball. He spears the ball. Over the top of the pack. Shields moves it now. Impey marks uncontested. Opportunity once again for Cawthorn to put one through. Over the top of the pack. 30 metres from home. Goes for the goals. That kick hits the post. 
Hawthorne by eight points. Hartley to bring it in. Plays on. on. Looks to move it by foot. A big contested grab. Even puts it on the boot. Stuck the mitts out there and held on to it. Clurry elects to kick. Jonas kicks hurriedly. Wines, Marks. Dishes it off. He wins possession. Takes possession. Decides to keep it alive. Couldn't complete the play. Ball out of bounds. Ball back into play. Dixon thumps it forward. Ends up with Frost. Ball collected. Westock with quick hands. Wines was taken high in the tackle. This is kickable by his stand. It's normally a good shot on goal. This will certainly test him from this distance. Okay. Burgoyne going for number one. The drop punt goes straight between the big sticks. Look at them celebrate that effort. Port Adelaide could kick back-to-back -back goals. Port Adelaide now only trailed by two. Has a runner alongside him. Wingard hacking it out of there. The first half comes to a close. And Port Adelaide face a two-point deficit. Hawthorne will go into the rooms at halftime with plenty of confidence and back themselves for the second half. Any thoughts from you, Gaz? Port Adelaide are allowing the opposition too much room on the outside. They need to close them down faster once they break away. Thanks for that. It's half time, and no doubt the coaches will want to have a chat to their teams about their first half performance. Ready to begin proceedings in the second half. We're back in motion. McAvoy won the hit out. Slams it onto the boot. Patton does well to mark. Not sure if he has the journey from here. Going for goal number one. That looked great. What a goal. He loved that one. The Hawks by eight points. Center bounce. Thumped clear. He gets his hands on the footy. Just dismisses his opponent. Ball picked up. Hacks it out of there. West off. Read it best. Gathered by Scully with a driving kick. Marking in space with Fiopolo. Goes by foot. Great mark under pressure. Hawthorne are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Bruce will be the recipient of the free. He decides to go for home. That one will really lift them. Of course, Hunter. They get around him after that effort. That's two in a row for Hawthorne. Now they lead by 14. Quick handball. Pal Pepper comes away with the ball. With the ball now. Ebert took his eyes off the ball. Burn Jones lobs the handball. Hacking it out of there. Finds this one all by himself. Rosie has resources out wide. Well collected. Used the hands and gives away the free. Now with a low spearing kick. Nice mark under pressure. About to take the kick. Slight angle. He goes it alone. Darts it through for another. That will settle the nerves. Gets his first on the board. Both enjoying that goal. Port Adelaide close the gap to eight. He knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. We resume hostilities. 
O'Brien clears the contest. Shields, the number one ranked player on the ground. He's on fire at the moment. Good mark there. He drives it. A solid mark from Ebert. Ebert went out in the square. An easy grab for Jonas. Uses it now. Finds the loose ball. Henderson goes off the ground. The ball in the hands of Burgoyne. Chose to kick it. Easily takes the mark. Hawthorne just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. The players will be feeling the heat right now. Rosie gets onto the ball. Glass puts the handball out in front. Mops up the loose ball. Sutcliffe dug out the loose ball. Frost couldn't hang onto the ball. Henderson brushed off easily. Drops the mark. Glass gets the handball away. Awkward handball there. Things not looking good for Wines. Gaz, can you tell us what you saw? Yeah, definitely something wrong here. He's trying to get off the ground as quick as he can. Just got the hands in the back there. O'Brien going for number one. Great grab. Hartlett tucks it into the pocket. Mark by Burn Jones. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. Cawthon forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. MP throws the ball away. The Hawks just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Put his body on the line. Moving on. Piopolo goes it alone. Sensed the opportunity and was able to take it. He's got a couple now. Starting to get into this game. Pretty happy with that one. Back with another centre bounce. Clears the contest. Is in his possession. Intercepted by Watts. Picked off by Stratton. Henderson. Hurry kick. They can create from this. Doing well was Burgoyne. Has it now. Handball. Finds Boak. Finding the ball with ease. Marks now and can send it back. Frost sends one up towards the wing. Pal Pepper. Looking a bit sluggish out there. A big contested grab. Goes by foot. The ball goes over the boundary near the 50. Advantage is taken. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? There's some great skills on display right now. It's a great match. Thank we'll you. have a ball up close to the boundary line. O'Brien thrashes it. Now we've got a ball up. Thrashes it. He's got the footy in his hands. Doing well with the mark. Need to be kick if he's going to put this through. West off with an opportunity for goal. 45 degree angle. 45 metres out. Move it on. Watts going for number one. A time to celebrate. Celebrating hard. Port Adelaide reduced the margin. The game is back underway. Big thump from O'Brien. Off the deck. Gets the loose ball. We'll get a stoppage. O'Brien with the hit. Clear free. Just put both hands in the back. Couldn't quite with the mark. At the end of three quarters, it's the Hawks 46, the Power 38. Hawthorne walk into three-quarter time with the lead and the confidence they can win this game. Let's have a closer look at the stats.
Port Adelaide haven't been able to get the ball forward enough to score. They need to get some repeating. Time to find out what happens in this final term. Can't afford any mistakes from here. They have to be perfect. He's getting a lot of the ball, Gaz. He just keeps finding the footy. Scrimshaw spills it. Bo collects the loose ball. Goes wide from behind. It's under two goals now. Plays on to himself. Kicks it out of the back 50. Pal Pepper got up, but couldn't bring it down. Fights the good fight. What suckers it forward? Williams needs a chance to rest. Westock going for number two. He's enjoying that goal. Port Adelaide have kicked the last two goals. Port Adelaide now only trail by one. Dug out the loose ball. Picks up the loose ball. Goes short by hand. Taken well at ground level by Mitchell. A lot of possessions for him. Quick handball. Rockcliffe onto the ball. The mark has been taken. Looks up with the kick. Rosie hangs onto that one. He's a long way from home, but he might have the wheels. Okay. Going for goal number one. He makes that kick count. Full price. Pretty happy with that one. They're in the lead now. Back in the middle now as the rucks go at it. Dixon got a fist to it. He's got the football now. The contest, no match for him. Good call, Hutto. Glass has resources out wide. Finds a bit of room to mark. Wingard with a spearing kick. It's been turned over. Finds a way to goal along the ground. Sutcliffe celebrates with the fans. Port Adelaide have four on the trot. The margin is 11. It's great to watch, Hutto. Plenty of excitement. Port Adelaide are converting their opportunities in front of goal. They're taking their chances, and that's why they find themselves in front. Cleary doesn't take the mark. Picks it up. Rushes with the kick. Frost has it. Port Adelaide haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning total that way. He doesn't want to let his teammates down with this shot at goal. Going for goal number one. Winning the ball in the air was Segler. Ten metres out. It on. Unbelievable effort. And it ends with a goal. A time to celebrate. And don't they get around Segler. There's nothing in this. O'Brien hurls it away. He has the ball. Takes the mark. 40 metres from home. They can't afford to be wasting these shots at goal from the corridor. He goes for broke. Drop punt straight through the middle. Another goal. He's kicked a couple now. Shields wouldn't be happier with that goal. Hawthorne goes back in front. Thumps it clear. Decides to soccer it. Watts decides to go for home. It's very tense at the moment. O'Brien thumps it clear. Moves it by foot, using every ounce of energy he has left. Looks like the ball will be coming back. He drives it. He takes the mark. Chips it towards half forward. A mark by Ebert. Looks to move it by foot. Hartley with the mark. Sinks the slipper into it. Marking in space with glass. Decides to kick. Frawley wins the ball in the air. Goes for territory. Kept alive under pressure. And the ball ends up over the line. 
thrown in now. Punches it clear. Puts boot to ball. Well taken at ground level. Williams quickly onto the boot. Wingard off the deck. Ball collected. Scully wins the foot race. Got boot to ball. MP goes with the kick. He looks like he needs a spell. A drop punt through the goals. Gunston celebrating hard. Hawthorne with the edge right now over the power. Centre bounce. McAvoy just swats it away. A chance for Burgoyne. Slick with the hands. The ball mopped up. Links with hands. Getting in the way was O'Brien. Impressive with the step. Dixon with a big fist on it. The loose ball picked up. And the umpire says, my ball. Punched away. Collected by Burton. Outstanding pressure. The ball ends up going to ground. The game has tightened right up. The ball is coming back into play. Hammers it. The loose ball scooped up. Gathers it now. What is the body to take that mark? The Hawks just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. He gets another possession. Just put it on the boot. Taking a nice grab. Fantastic result for fans of Hawthorne. What stood out for you today, Gas? They just had more players playing their role today. And when footy is so even these days, that was the difference in the end. The final scores are in. The Hawks, 64. Port Adelaide, 57. Thanks for joining us. As always, it's been a pleasure. We look forward to seeing you back soon. It was great to be here, Hutto. I'll be back next time.